What's your ethnicity? Where's your parents from? That's Jamaican. My mum's Bayesian. Okay, right. You don't have to do me with an accent. No, I, <laughs> I, I know, Mister. I know, Mister. Know how to do it. Yeah. Why for that? Why for that? Why for that? That's so. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't. I don't have a clue. But I, I know the the, the Bayesian accent is worse than the Dominican accent. Have mm. you got children? Yeah, yeah, I got children. How yeah. many? I got three children. You got boys and one, girls. One that died. Really, I'm um, sorry to hear that, that, man. Well, R.I.P. Man. Sorry, I'm so yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Came up there two, as well, wife two, for that. Boy. But mm. the Luton, Luton. Yeah, yeah, that was a that was the um Chris that was a christening. You're gonna you gonna, <laughs> we gotta get into oh, that one day. What a mad spray, you know? <laughs> yeah, but that's another story. I don't mm. know. You can lead on that one if you like. But yeah, why, um, man? Uh, for that, but uh, then, um, um, yeah, my my oldest is. Um, 25. Mm-hmm. And then my second's 24. Is Lamar 25 now, yeah? 25. Oh, okay. Well, no, he's 25 in December. So, yeah, and Lamar and Rashawn's 24 in November. Mm-hmm. And then Cutie Pie Sarai, she's, um, she just turned 15. Oh, you know okay. I mean? And my little man, Kayan, who died, he would have been, he would have been 16. Really? Mm-hmm. How was that? How did that feel? Yeah. Had you had youths already by then? Yeah, Lamar and That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so at least you had a youth. Yeah. But it was still mad, though. Yeah, come on, man. It was mad still. Yeah, so... He fucked you up, you know, for a bit. Yeah, of course As he did, man. Would, yeah. No, 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 he fucked him up for a bit. Of course he did. I don't did, know if he man. knew it, but if no, he no, realised it. No, fu- it fucked me up. For a good <laughs> few years, you get me? Like, mm. Yeah, no, because uh, when... When I'm out... Um, Missus at the time, <clears throat> she um, had the baby. Like, the doctor said that he was dead when he wasn't, you know. Mm. So, like, there was a midwife there, a black midwife. She said, no, he's not dead. We're going to try. So they, so I'm thinking, like, what? He said, my son's dead and he ain't dead. You mad? Because he was premature. Mm-hmm. Born after six months. So he weighed 660 grams. He wasn't developed properly, but he, 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 on the outside, he, everything was developed, but he was just really small. But a little That's bit bigger than my hand, to get me? Mm. But, um, yeah, for these doctors to, to say that he's he's um, dead and he ain't, it was a madness to me, get me? So when she said he's not, this was Homerton Hospital, so mm. they tried. Putting them out there, yeah. Mm-hmm. Putting them out there, putting them on blast. Nah, they got to get blast still mm-hmm. straight. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, I, one time I actually came to the hospital and I see my youth man had turned blue, you know. Mm. Like, you know, like when you hear people say like, yo, he turned blue, fam. Mm. You're thinking like, blue, really? Mm. You get me? But it's actually really a thing. My son turned blue. So I've, I've gone in there. I said, yo, why is my little man blue? And, like, really staying blue, you know? Like, why is he... Oh, he's having trouble breathing, blah, blah, blah. So I'm looking at them like, hmm? Not really. So, so what well, now? I sat down. I sat down with him one day, and there's, like, bare incubators, and there's three nurses at the back, and they're talking, and an incubator over there just starts going mad, bare noise, like, this incubator needs attention now, Yeah. And they forgot I was there. Mm-hmm. So about 10 seconds, because I was reading a book at the time, a piece of cake, Cupcake Brown, yeah. So I'm reading this book, and because my little man's sleeping. So 10 seconds now, whoa, whoa, beep, 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 beep. Get me, I'm looking over there, I'm saying, right. You get me? I know they're, they're behind, or they're just talking. 20 seconds, still talking. It could have taken them three seconds to get there and attend to that baby. 30 seconds, I stuck my head around the corner. They're like, oh, you get me? Mm. You understand? Then they rushed. I said, yo, listen, my baby needs to come out of here now. You understand? So the next day, he got taken to Royal London. Royal London, uh, White Trouble. Yeah, Royal London. And two weeks later, he died there. But I I, I can't say nothing bad about that hospital. They mm-hmm. tried, you understand? I, I felt the love. I felt the love in that hospital right there. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Homer and yeah, Royal Hospital. That's, well, that's all right, isn't it? Yeah. Royal London was all right. Royal London was all right, but um, but yeah, and then and that's mad though, having to bury. Your come child. on, 
And then the day the after I buried him, the police him. grabbed me and I. Why? What? The police grabbed me the day after I buried him. For something. Imagine I'm with my youths now. I'm about to take them home. And the police come grab me in the market. Mm. For some little fraud thing they was accusing me of. Wolfenstone. Yeah, yeah Wolfenstone Market. Grab me in the market. Yeah, you'd like the 419 still up, guy, man. What? Yeah, you did like the 419. Yeah, from yeah, there now. Okay, man. From there now, Allegedly. I'm fighting yeah. the case. Mm. But it's all a situation under them circumstances. Well, it's just, mad. yeah, yeah. It's mad. So when Spray say, I was, my head weren't there mm-hmm. good for a minute. My head weren't good. Mm. For a couple of years. Mm. My head weren't good. But, um, you know, like, and that's what made me decide to write my book in my son's memory. You feel me? Really? Oh, so, right, okay. We've, we've actually um, fingered this on the show, you know. Mm-hmm. Can't remember what I'd remember, I'd, yeah, 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 I think that was when we was in Deluxe's, you know. Yeah, it was in Deluxe's. Because I remember the cover. I that, yeah, I actually episode, remember this cover of the book. No, it was, um, my, uh, it was my man from Walk From The Ends as well, the rapper. What's his name? Um, from The Ends? Was it Stanner? No, no, not, not Stanner, um... It, no, it was um, what's the other one? Um, big Tobes. Was it Big Tobes? Was it Big Tobes? Yeah, done big up Big Tobes, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that yeah. was in Rana's place. <laughs> oh, okay. But I remember this. Um, the cover. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So in my son's memory, I said, you know what? Let me tell my story, mm-hmm. but in a way where it engages with the youths, mm-hmm. but it teaches them something. They learn something, can they? It, they begin to enjoy reading because reading is the key. Hmm. Okay, the synopsis is in a product of my environment is my true life story written in memory of my son. It represents an emotional journey in a London far removed from the glitz and glamour the world sees. From a boy living for the moment in the belly of broken Britain to a man determined to defy the odds. This book exposes the reality of urban youth growing up in London's inner city. Youth that are forced to find their own way within society often leading to the inevitable temptations of crime. Because last time I, I, I read something about that Dachavelli and then they put it on shade bar like, man can't read. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I couldn't believe it. But these times it's just small on my phone. I couldn't, you know what I mean? Mm. Thinking I can't read. A real A star um, English student. Mm. You get me? Like, yeah. Yeah. So, so, so with that now, I, I, and this, my first book took 10 years to write now. Mm. Like, but it, it was a lot, it's a lot bigger than that. But when, when I saw. Do you write the, it yourself, yeah? Yeah, I wrote it myself, yeah. Did you? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, so, mm. so when I when I so got the copy of all of it, I said, "Yo, my target audience ain't gonna read this." You understand? I said mm. to myself, "It's t- it's too big." Mm-hmm. So I broke it into part one, mm-hmm. and part, there's three parts really. But I haven't even released the next part because after I released this one, now I learned a little bit about publishing. Mm-hmm. So come time now to publish this book. And I bought 10 ISBNs. So from I bought the 10 ISBNs, in essence, I've become a publisher. So I said to myself, boy, I've got to write some more books now. I'm a publisher, you feel me? So I, would, uh, so I, linked, I linked with Reggie. Hmm. You understand? Madman Reggie. Madman Reggie. And I convinced him over time to tell his story. So I said, yo, listen, just... I'll, I'll write it. Just tell me. So, so when I'd convinced him, I swear you put me in that book, man. Yeah, he did put you in that book. Yeah, I was in jail with him, innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 You were in that book, yeah. I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah. I ain't read it, but I <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I was so, mad, but so, I even read his book. Yeah. Mm. So boom, I'm now we, mad. we've 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 read, read his book now. Nah. Talk, guy, mad. I know, I know him, innit? Yeah, I can't yeah. believe you were able to read your book. <laughs> no, but you know, you know, yeah. man. That's mm. not no, for I put, me. no, no, no. I, I think wrote, you were to read your book. I think you were to read your book, the read your book and yeah. you're in your 30s. Remember, yeah. he's, he's done that, like, he's done that from he's in his 30s. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm thinking you're going mad. So, Reggie, now, nah, boom. That's definitely <clears> main when, character syndrome. Doing a biography in your 30s is main character syndrome. 
No, nah, because no, you no, got more to, to, sometimes you got to wait before you do your story. No, anyway. but remember, yeah, I, I, I didn't, got I, wait. I didn't yeah. even Not intend right. to, but in my son's Oh, yeah, oh, I get what you mean. Like, you done it on, soon. Please. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Please get with me with I what know. I'm saying. <laughs> please get with yeah. me with what I'm saying. Yeah, it's main you. character syndrome. I get it. I get it. Do a biography in your 30s. Something yeah, you still got bare things more. You feel like you're the main character in this yeah. film. You definitely feel like you're the main character in this movie. You've got main character syndrome. You know what I'm saying? You want a book, a biography in your 30s. Mm. That's why I build back. Remember, I was doing my book. Mm-mm-mm. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking, right, wait, yeah, wait. I've got bare stabs and mm. I'm thinking, right, I need to write a book. Mm. I've had to realise, listen, calm down. There's more chapters. There's more chapters. Mm. Do you get what no, I'm saying? No, if, I would, if I would, if I my book, I wouldn't have been able to re- write about that podcast. Podcast, mm. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know that was the next chapter. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I did. You get what I'm saying? But, but at the same time, it's good to start. They can't, they can't kill to, me, blood. It's good to start. <laughs> okay, man. <laughs> but he said he's done his in parts, isn't it? So he's done his. He's no, done his you know that, in parts. I don't need to rush my thing. I don't need to rush my book. You get no air on the red carpet. I don't need to rush my thing. <laughs> He gave me El Mega. He gave me El Mega. He gave me El Mega. But yeah, I don't need to rush my thing. You will you know, get my book in my 90s. <laughs> Post it then. I'm sorry. That was a quick outburst. That's the sorrow. I think that might be the sorrow.